Thank you. Where is everyone? Oh, um, my parents are going to work in. My little brothers are in school. So, you are alone? Oh, yes, please. <laughs> okay, please, this way. Come with me, please. Really? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Charlie, how may I help you? Oh, by you. What is this? So then the answer call. By you are no ball. Um, they leave you, you get them. Yeah, I get them. Uh, Charlie, you boys for Louis Sharp then caught your ticket too. Have you been flying? Where did they go? Eh? See your man. You say we did take flight. Eh? Ah. Charlie, see, we, we don't want to experience the road, though, bro. We don't want to tow the road. So, show what's at the top. Ah. Charlie, flight there slow. We go catch ride, you know. We don't want to experience the road trip for real. Oh, which, which experience the road again? She wants to do road, man. Tell me, make us sort you out. Eh? This is not the road matters. Like 45 minutes straight. We are in Tamale. Eh, we don't get. Out. Charlie, um, okay, you are one day, we go with the flight. Ah, Charlie, no, 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 no. I should talk road today, be road now, we go. First things first, you choose the road, so move to road, okay? See this guy. <laughs> Can I offer you water? I'm okay. Oh, okay. Well, what about soft drinks? Um, I'm okay. Or you prefer alcohol? <laughs> no, I don't think I'll Oh, okay, that's fine. <laughs> okay, let's hear. What? What you've been so eager to tell me? <laughs> Alright, here goes. You remember the last time we met? At the supermarket? No, before that, at the gardens. You were with your boyfriend. Well, ex boyfriend. I actually came there because I had a misunderstanding with my girl and you were at the verge of breaking up. When I saw you two together, it just made me realize how much I love her and I went and patched things up with her. Wow. See, I told you it sounds silly. Oh no, it's actually very sweet. Thank you, thank you. Well, I don't know what is going on between you, but I could clearly see that the love between you guys was genuine. And in this crazy world where people are looking to use people, that is not a love that you throw away. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Please, the headman wants to see you. Is he in his office? Yes, please. He's with Mr. Lassan. Ah, don't stop from him again. Take your seat, then. I'm in a. Yes, sir. Make sure no one touches my boots, huh? Okay, sir. Good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon. There is an issue at hand. And if we don't take care, it may disrupt our academic schedule. I don't know how many of you who have noticed this. There has been a drop in attendance, especially amongst our female students. That is true, sir. I tried to follow up on some of them. And aside a few who have just been missing school due to illness, most of them are with child. Hmm. Yes, this issue of teenage pregnancy is getting out of hand. These children need parental control and support. Some of these men are also taking advantage of the economic situation of these girls, luring them into doing things with them. This is serious. I don't even think they are using uh, 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 protection. There is the huge risk of contracting HIV or other STIs. I've been no say HIV for go town, then go sort one or three things out. Eh? We I will go buy the tickets. I've been just say go movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Charlie, me say I for pass through the barber shop, then do some shaving and things, and also grab some one or two shadows. Yo, psycho. Sick of the trip, you won't go buy shadows. Hey. I made this trip since the 80s. Wow. The trip with the worst pony. 
in the house. Yo, you, you know something, eh? I go go Jen in there. From there, I'll go now in there. You, these two friends where you won't date, G, you go backfire. Bro, I know what I did do. Let's also not forget about it. The cholera and other water related diseases that have hit the community. What do we do to help? If I may. Oh, yeah. I think aside pushing for the provision of water and sanitation facilities, we could also encourage and educate the youth and the community in general on good hygiene practices. With regards to teenage pregnancy, we can advise the girls to get into some jobs and make a good living. This will make them less dependent. That's a good idea. I think we could start with the students, with every teacher, teaching their class on the importance of practicing good hygiene. We don't have to tell them only the importance. We have to give them the practical example as well. <laughs>